Welcome to my channel and today I'm going to be discussing um, something about methods of a project oriented programming. So if you watch my previous uh, video, um, you can see it um, if you um, search uh, YouTube and type in Paul Solweis and um, you will see this um, logo here, Paul Aguilar. And, um, that's my first uh, video here, SAP Extract Data, ALV plus a uh, different uh, T code. The summary of that uh, video is this one. So I have I have created a, a class in, and inside that class there's a method. And inside the method there is a submit program, a submit command. I am calling a different program and this is the program that I'm calling. And inside this uh, program, there is an ALV um, grid that was uh, displayed. And the goal is to transfer that data into this uh, method. So uh, this is the class I'm talking about, ZCL sales, ZCL sales data. And uh, if we display this one, um, let's uh, run it first, okay? Run it. And this is the method. That I'm talking about in the previous uh, picture, get our run it, and um, and this is the program. I'm opening it up. Uh, orders four nine six nine run it, and this is the ALV grid uh, display. So let's try to um, copy this uh, four nine six nine um, sales document. Uh, paste it over here and the date the update this is the audit run it and that's the sales um, document type or our and is it right yep they're right that's right and uh, let's go inside this uh, code here change I forgot to delete it. Uh, let's delete it first. Okay, so this is the only method here that I've uh, created initially. So if we go inside this uh, method by double clicking it, oh, sorry. Let's go to the uh, class again and the method here. Click that button here, there to view the code. And inside this method, uh, there's the submit command and I'm calling this a uh, program and uh, using the this um, uh, internal table uh, for the selection parameters so how are we go um, uh, this is um, this is the goal here um, the goal is to put this um, uh, code section here inside the method so um, how are we gonna do that so we need to create a go back to the main class and uh, under methods, uh, let's uh, create one set uh, param and let's uh, use static method and public enter and under this um, method, let's uh, click that parameters on button there and uh, we will be entering here. Uh, the import parameters and export. Let's uh, copy the ones from get our tier. Let's uh, copy this uh, IVV villain there after this. I just uh, hit the uh, control Y and um, highlighted this um, uh, section here in control C. And let's go back to set parameters and paste those uh, uh, parameters there. And uh, we will also be needing an export uh, parameter. That's uh, RT cell screen. In, no. Uh, returning there. And what should be the associated type? Uh, we cannot uh, enter a structure here. Uh, let's uh, do all that for the meantime. Let's uh, check what's the um internal table type for this one 
LT cell screen. If you double click that, this is the declaration RS params. So this is a structure here. Structure there. So uh, how are we going to find a table type? I just want to set something's wrong with my mouse. There. Uh, hit this one. Where use this? Uh, unselect the other check marks there and find table types. And hit OK. And uh, let's use this one. Genetic interface. If you double click this, yep, it's using uh, RS params. Um, structure. So let's copy the copy this one and let's go back. Set our um, parameter. Let's enter that table type. Okay, uh, save and uh, let's copy the code uh, from get our work method. Where's the code? There's a code there. Cut it. Control. Set params. Hmm. I've uh, created it a while ago, but uh, somehow it's still there. <laughs> it's weird. Anyways, um, uh, basically I've um, copied and uh, pasted the uh, code in this um, uh, new method. And we will be renaming some of the uh, fields here. So LT cell screen, we're not going to use this one. We're going to use RT cell screen instead. So RT and RT there and RT there. And um, IV audit. Yep, it's still the same. IV VBLIN. There, audit and VBLIN. Let's save. So basically, um, we're just uh, filling out, filling up this um, internal table here with the fields s out that and s in, and the values for those are passed in the low um, field. Let's go back. Get our. Now, what are we? How we are we gonna call the method? So that's simple. Just uh, hit pattern there, and um, select um, ABAP objects patterns. Okay. And under class, what's the name of the class? This is the class here. ZCO sales data, and the method. If you go here and hit F4, it's going to tell you your options. So we're selecting set param and OK. There you go. That's uh, neat. And IV VBLIN, same VBLIN. And IV audit, let's copy the import parameter uh, for this uh, method, get our IV, IV audit, and what will be the, let's uh, copy this one, LT cell screen, there, uh, we're going to delete now the work area, LS cell screen, so we're not going to use that anymore, it's uh, already used inside the set param method, and activate.
Let's try running it. Set break of point first. Run. Uh, let's run get network. That's a main method there. IDD balloon. 4969. How oh, that? And run. Uh, LT cell screen. It's a zero. And if we hit F6, it has two values now. Let's check. That's the date, out that. And we fill in 4969. And if we're going to submit it, Go. 4969. How come the hour here is a DA? So let's check. 4969. Let's go to SC16N. It's supposed to be OR. OR, right? OR, seal supplement time. So let's uh, check SC16N. EBEC. 4969. And where is. Uh, work there. Run it. If you double click it, or TA. So basically, this is the display name and this is the internal name. Uh, let's check the TA. TA there. And there you go. Uh, that's uh, how simple. Uh, uh, we could uh, create a method and uh, call it. In the next sessions, I will teach you how to uh, manipulate the method, redefine, something like that. And uh, thanks for watching. Have a good day.